Man, I believe in you. <laughs> I'm glad you do. <laughs> like that that's the only answer I can give to you, right? Yeah, well, you. This is oh. awesome. I hate this stage. Look, we are gonna get through this stage, Matt. You okay. got this. Mm, <laughs> yeah. I'm like Rob 64, except this isn't the Nintendo 64 or Star Fox 64. Oh. Yo, know, you got the shield. Oh, 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 oh. Bomb, 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 bomb. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man. So let's talk about this address. You know, okay, so we we stay in North Carolina, and we started this channel in January, so we were talking about this a little bit in January. Yes. But. Excuse me. Continue. Sorry. We live in North Carolina, and the temperature change is drastic. North Carolina's weather is just all over the place. But can we talk about how, like, a week ago, it was just sunny, and there was no, it was all kind of warm and stuff, and now it's like, God cold out there. Right. Like, it's so freaking cold. And it was just out of nowhere. Okay. So we're avo <sighs> we're avoiding. We're avoiding. Oh, uh, don't the shield you would think, out. You would think I've lived in North Carolina my whole life. My whole life. And I'd be used to this. But I'm really, I'm really not. It's hard to get used to the weather. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, I could. I, it's so hard to dodge them and. Can you it, attack while you're breaking? Yes, but it's kind of hard to do properly, in my opinion. Oh my god, you got this. It looks like you're fighting a carnival barrel. You know this is going to do a lot of damage, so you got to... Yeah. I kind of accidentally launched the bomb in a weird way. I don't understand how I'm supposed to dodge that, honestly. Like, you it's really roll? weird. It, you cannot barrel roll those blasts. It'll still do damage to you. Okay, oh. Matt. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. This is so, so not guys, fun. This is intense. So I'm trying to be supportive of Matt. Still getting hit. And I was still firing the entire time. It's just hard to. Hit. Oh no. Oh no. Darn it. Man, I think you can barrel roll those. Get those I things. just tried. You didn't barrel roll it. I, I literally hit LL. With but that you, break in between, I couldn't barrel roll. Yeah, you were. Yeah, you didn't. Like, it might be a thing that you can do, but it is hard to do in this game. Oh no. Hey, I got a credit at some point. Yay! You got that credit when you got that stupid 100%. Yay, I needed that. Badly. Uh, uh, oh, God. Uh, We're going to try this again, everybody. Oh, my God. Skip. We already know. Yeah, we already know. We're going into Venom's butthole. We got this. <laughs> we got it. Yeah, yeah, first person view because blah. Uh, and I actually have to go through this entire stage without having the double blaster, too. Oh. Splattering. Come on, and barrel, please. So I know you're concentrating, but yes. while during a brace, you were talking about the show Orville. What? Oh, yeah. What is uh, that? So the Orville is. Think of a show kind of like Star Trek. But it's made by um, uh, Brian Griffin, uh, Seth MacFarlane. Seth MacFarlane. Yes, it's made by him, and he's also like the main character. Oh, I saw the, I saw the previews for that. Yeah. yeah, I've been I've been watching it. It's actually really good. Um, now, are we talking about it's actually really good, or is it like Family Guy, where people are hypnotized to think that it's good? Okay. Um. The Okay, that's actually a big issue with the show, is the fact that because it was brought by Seth MacFarlane, everybody was expecting it to be a full-on comedy show, like, you know, like what he's known for, pretty mm -hmm. much. But he actually wanted to be more like Star Trek, a more, like, it has its more humorous side to it, but it's actually supposed to be taken as a more serious show. 
Really? Yeah. It looked the previews made it look like it was goofy. Exactly, and that was one of the issues because apparently, um, I guess it was Fox. They should have Fox. Yeah. Apparently, Fox was like, "Yeah, you've like made us a whole crap ton of money with Family Guy, so you can totally make your own show and be the star in it." A crap ton of money. Because I mean, isn't even like right. They've literally Family Guy kept. Fox on the air, pretty much. Well, that and Simpsons, because Simpsons yeah. have been around forever in a day. And like, it's still going. Oh, no. Bye, Peppy. But there's people I know who started watching Simpsons when they were a teenager, and now their teenagers are watching the same show. Oh, yeah. I literally grew up with The Simpsons. Like, I remember watching, like, one of the first seasons when I was... And it wasn't even the first season. It was just one of the earlier seasons when I was young. Simpsons look rough. When Simpsons first came out, oh, man, right. Simpsons look rough. And I mean, super rough. <laughs> like, I, uh, oh my God, I, I, the animation was not for me. And, but when it got into that, 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 that kind of groove in like the mid 90s. Yeah, the mid 90s is when it started looking nice. Yeah, that's when it started to actually look good. And then they used to play like an hour of Simpsons every night on Fox or some some Fox and actually I think at one point it was on UPN a lot. Yeah, it was on one of those other networks forever, and it was. It was just, always on like the basic channels. Yeah, though, but they showed like yeah. an hour special, and that's yep. how I watched a lot of Simpsons. Same here. And then I was not able to watch Simpsons because apparently it was an evil influence. Right. Because Bart Simpson was such a brat. Like people tried saying that he was supposed to be like the devil trying to influence you and stuff. Yeah, it was bad. Man, no wonder this boss is rough. I saw how much damage you actually did with a blaster shot. It was minuscule. Right? <laughs> this is such a dumb fight. I believe in you, Matt. Like, the bomb's not even doing anything to it, and those are all shiny spots on it. Like, yeah. I was breaking the entire time. Mm, you're also missing a wing. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so that, that could be a determinant factor. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Uh, you you can't. Like, I mean, I know can I'm missing... You barrel, can you not barrel low? I can try. But now he's down there, so it's going to be a bad idea. Barrel roll to the left. Barrel roll to the left. Barrel roll to the left. Oh my Breaking, god. barrel rolling, and shooting all at the same time. Nothing. That's... I really don't understand this oh. boss. Oh, uh, quit me in first person view. Maybe if you actually fall the boss in first person, it'd be easier. You know what? Why not give it a try? Man. The dinosaur was really majestic. It really was. Like, if you actually think about it, like, that decade in terms of, like, Digital entertainment growth, right? Crazy. It was massive. Like just a prime example with the '90s. I mean, with the Simpsons. Like when the Simpsons first debuted, in I think actually '89. It was it '89 or '90? I can't remember. I think it was. I think it was '89, but I'm, I can't remember for a fact. Like if you look at that first episode, and you know everyone improves and things improve and things change, but it is a. Drastic, drastic change from the first episode of The Simpsons to the last episode or last season that aired in 1999. I forgot what season that was. It's so much improvement. Yeah. Now, Matt, when I suggested that you fight the boss of first person, you know you could do the whole stage. Yes, I know. And but I, I was trying to get used to the first person view. Uh, yeah, I mean, that makes sense. I'm the sword. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now I'm not saying it was the best idea, but that's what my thought process was for. I, I know I touched that ring. <sighs> okay. What do you think the Star Fox crew does in their downtime? Hate on each other. You gotta move back. I I was holding my brakes were out. I had used them entirely. When do you start breaking? Right about here. Uh, Shouldn't you wait and then break? I was I was shooting my blaster the entire time, but nothing was coming out. 
Mm. That was weird. Mm. My last life. Man, I believe in you. <laughs> I'm glad you do. <laughs> like that that's the only answer I can give to you, right? Yeah, Here. This is oh. this God. Is, this is rough. We ain't doing difficulty three. What? <laughs> Dude, I can't even beat difficulty two! You can. I, you just gotta believe. You got this. If it wasn't possible, it wouldn't have sold. Well, this was back in the 90s. Impossible games sold. Battletoad sold. Oh, uh, yeah. It's not impossible. It's just hard as all get it, out. Yeah. Still, my point stands. What? I mean, eh. I I mean, don't get me wrong. I like a challenging game. I actually do. Yeah, but I think we, I think in myself especially, we've gotten so used to games that aren't hard. Right. And when we try to go back to games that are actually decently hard, that it actually, have a true it, challenge it, it really, them, yeah. it really shines. Like, I mean, like nowadays, do you play games on the natural difficulty or do you usually set them to hard? It depends. Like, some games I like to ease myself into it before I just go guns a blazing in the hard mode. Understandable. Like, I don't. I actually like to l learn the game before and go up in the scale and difficulty. Right. But some games, like, this this gives you multiple levels, which is great. But some games were just hard outright. Like, Battletoads. Battletoads yeah. is just outright hard. Castlevania, outright hard. Yep. Zelda 1, just outright hard. And then they give you a more difficult quest. Kiss my ass, Ganon. Right. <laughs> like that it, one and the first castle being like, hey, do you want to try uh, it on a harder difficulty? Uh, <laughs> nope. Um, uh, okay, max health. PTSD. Okay. Oh, just about max health. <laughs> right. Just keep firing. Just yeah. Just just let him have it. Just let him. You gotta aim, aim and let aim and let him have it. Aim okay, slow it down. It. He's telling me to slow it down now. So I'm slowing it down now. And I was shooting the entire time. You like. And those are destroyable because I was destroying them on the field. Shit, I did that horribly. Mm. I'm not gonna win this one. Matt, That's believe. Not good. I mean, I'm trying. Like, I'm not giving up, but it's just. Breaks? Nothing. Like. <sighs> that time you didn't so get crushed. That was the. But I mean, I can't dodge them because they follow me. Oh God. Okay. My God, this is. I'm about to say, why don't you use the bombs to focus on destroying them, and then you just. Because when I do that, then I forget to focus on that usually. Ah, user error. So yeah, we know what to do. Yeah, there we go. Use the bombs to clear those out. Back up, back up, back up, back up. I'm back trying. Up. I'm trying. Ooh, I only got two bombs left. That's not good. And he's now gonna start doing that. See, that's not gonna get hit at all. Oh, that was a lucky dodge, and I don't think I did any damage to him either. You did some. He's at half health. Below half health. Keep going. Keep going. Now, uh, right. maybe, maybe, maybe. No, he launched it late that time. Ah. Uh. I think we're gonna have to pause. I think. <clears throat> How much time do we have, Bob? Um, uh, hold on, Bob. Well, you knew this just in time, because that's the end of this episode. Oh, yay, look at that happy screen. Okay. Well, I think. Oh. Bob, what? Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> What's the Thanks, question Bob. of the day? Um, okay. Uh, have you ever gone back to a game that you haven't played in a long time, and it was much harder than you remember it being? Let us know in the comments below. This is one of them. Yeah. Castlevania was one of them, too. Yep. Castlevania came and kicked me in the ass. <laughs> oh, God, I'm not... Which, remember, to feel free to check out our Castlevania playthrough. If you want to... It's not Halloween anymore, but if you want to yeah. see me genuinely get destroyed by a game, please 
check out the Castlevania playthrough. I will love you forever and ever. Right. You guys are awesome. Y'all stay sexy. And until next time, see ya. Hit it.